Happy New Year, guys! Happy New Year! It is officially January 1. It is right now 2019 at 12 a.m. The first minute of 2019. Hi, guys. So, before we proceed, don't mind the way it looks. Like, don't mind anything. It's just. It's a hard day. It's a hard time. But that's what we're gonna talk about. Um, I recorded myself like holding my eyes out just because of what happened. And I'm so much shocked and in disbelief. And I feel like I'm still processing it. But that's 2019. That's how it's gonna begin. Anyways, so for this video, for this part of the video. You're gonna see what has happened like during the last month of 2018. It's gonna be like a short recap, and then you're gonna get back to the video. So let's roll those clips in. I shall see you guys in a few. Guys, I just came for my final exam. The semester is officially over. How did it go? Bad! <laughs> like really bad. I don't even know why I'm laughing. Like it never went good at all. And yeah. I'm expecting to fail the class because this is just how I felt about the midterm but the midterm I didn't even bother to study Let's see but now <laughs> I'm gonna go home and start enjoying my life waiting for I don't even know when the nanny the results will come out but whenever they come out I shall check and see what my grade is and we shall hope for the best <laughs> So the second video is done. I am thirsty, I am dry, I am out of breath, I am hungry, but I have to film this last video and also take like a Christmas picture and then we shall be done. We will be accomplished and I have to go take off my own laundry. But after that we shall be done and I can take a rest. I think I've been doing a great job so far. I think I've done a great job so far, so let's get changed for the last video and then we shall call it a day. Okay guys, so I'd say earlier on, it is 2019, we have made it to another year. Happy New Year to each and every one of you and I wish you the best of success and may God continue to guide your journey and may all your wishes and dream come true for this year and may you be hard working and may resolutions be conquered so let's give my recap for 2018 so 2018 for me has been would I say intense I feel I remember rooting for new year I feel like they have it has I had like 2017 might have been more intense than 2018 but overall 2018 my goal was to continue my growth journey and I feel like I've grown so much in 2018 now I've had a lot of good memories like going to Mexico and my trip to Tanzania where I visited like a lot of cities <laughs> a lot of cities in Tanzania and things like that and it was just a great experience. I've also, I think I've accomplished a lot of my goals and maybe I'll write a blog post about that, but I don't think I'll make like a whole video talking about my goals for 2018 and how I accomplished that. It's not something I want to do this year. So yeah, I've accomplished like a good percentage of my goals and life has taught me a lot. I've had a lot of breakdown in 2018. Anyway, moments where I just just question life in general and certain people in my life. But all in all, it has taught me to be strong. It has taught me that I can rely on myself. It has taught me that there are people in my life that are there to support me. And it has taught me that circumstances sometimes might show you who someone is, but don't necessarily define the person and also my circumstances don't define me how I'm going to react to those circumstances that's what is going to define me and what I choose to 
learn from those circumstances may also make an impact in my life but just because I was down or something like that doesn't mean that's how my life is like I'm a downer I'm a loser it just means it was a moment in my life and I got up and I'm here guys so 2018 has been good to me and 2019 I hope you'll be better to me and Ah, I'm just gonna share my word for 2019 here just because I'm not gonna make a 2019 video but my word for 2019 is Yasiri Ambayo which means in English um, brave so I have grown and then now we're gonna continue with the growth and what I'm hoping to be able to do is be brave enough to stand for what I believe in, to speak up my thoughts and to just express myself without the fear of being judged or or receiving backlash. Okay, so yeah. 2019 is gonna be a fun year and I'm just gonna yeah, just end this video here so that my boyfriend is really tired of my channel. But as you've reached here, you know what to do, subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. Kwa herini, heri ya mwakampia.